welcome back to another Honkai Impact 3 video. It's your homie Cody GT and in today's video my boys what I want to go ahead and do is get a bit of a discussion going on because as we know the Hersha Reason is coming right around the corner and I thought it would be really fun to discuss the Hersha Void versus the Hersha Reason. So in the comments below, let me uh, know who you guys think is better, who you like better as far as aesthetics is concerned, as far as the lore behind them, as far as the character themselves. Um, I thought it would just be fun to go ahead and discuss. I thought it would be a really fun video to just go ahead and play with the Hersh of the Void and kind of discuss who you guys like better and who do you think is better. Now, keep in mind, obviously, myself, I have not had a chance to play with the Hersh of Reason. I don't know much about the Hersh of Reason as far as skills, gameplay, things of that nature. So in the comments below, you guys who have played with her because, you know, she has been out can let me know um, who you like better or who you enjoy or who you think is better. Um, but as of right now, I thought it'd be a fun discussion. HOV versus HOR. So let me go ahead and jump into some gameplay and then we'll go ahead and get some of that discussion going. So I'll see you in just a second. All right, my boys. So like I mentioned, I did want to get a bit of a discussion going between the Hersher of the Void and the Hersher of Reason. So um, what I wanted to go ahead and discuss is who do you guys think is going to be better? Who do you guys enjoy more? And who do you guys are probably, I, I wouldn't say more hype for because obviously you cannot be hyped for the Hersher of Void anymore, even though uh, some could argue that. <laughs> but um, let me know who, who do you guys enjoy as a character more as well so as we all know when the Hersh of the Void had dropped um, she was extremely hype she was extremely overpowered she still is like I mentioned she is probably the best Valkyrie in the game um, in my opinion and so she just was extremely extremely hype when she was first announced and when she was first introduced into the game much like the Hersh of Reason um, is right now the Hersh of Reason is extremely hype she is extremely um, hyped up as a character and coming to the game here very soon. So I thought it would be a great chance to go ahead and compare and to kind of um, discuss them both as the Hersha Reason will be coming out here very, very soon. So um, with that being said, I don't know much about the Hersha Reason like I mentioned before. All I really know is that she's going to be Ice Elemental type of Valkyrie. Um, I believe she will be doing uh, some type of burst damage. Um, she will have a meter of some sort. She'll be able to ride the bike and things of that nature. So all of that is extremely exciting as it is all different to what we have right now in a sense. So um, she's going to bring a different dynamic, a different type of gameplay. And that is something to be really uh, excited for and looking forward to. Um, now, when it came to the Hersh of the Void, she did something very similar as bringing a new type of gameplay, um, being able to do a massive amount of physical damage. So that's where they're going to be different in that aspect is one is physical, one is elemental. Um, so there's a difference right there in of itself. Um, but it's, it's, very, it's very hard without having played with the Hersh of Reason just yet. Um, to really know which one I would enjoy more, which one do I think is better, or which one I am more excited for. Um, because when God Kiana did come out, I was extremely hyped up for God Kiana, as I think most everybody was. Um, and then now that the Hersha Reason is coming out, Bronya, um, everybody is extremely hyped about that. I believe, at least I am. <laughs> <laughs> and I, you know, I just cannot wait to, you know, try, try her out and try her gameplay style and see, you know, the damage that she does output to see what she's really capable of. That's going to be exciting. So without actually having played with her, it's very hard to determine. So those of you who have played with her, let me know who you enjoy more, HOV or HOR. Um, that's going to be really exciting. And I thought, like I mentioned, with uh, HOR coming around the corner here very soon, I thought it would be a great time to go ahead and discuss that as you know just something to go ahead and talk about and to hype up version 3.3 to come here very soon um, so let's go ahead and get some more damage off here so um, as we all know Hersha the Void is known for the burst damage being able to really output a massive amount of damage now she is uh, equipment dependent 
uh, very gear dependent. So if you have her gear, you have it maxed out, um, then she's going to really be your best Valkyrie on the team, no doubt about it. Especially if you know how to play with her properly, use her skills properly, she is definitely going to be um, your number one Valkyrie when it comes to, at least damage-wise anyways. Um, her, her ability to keep distance as well is fantastic. Um, not That really increases her survivability. And then the ultimate evasion, um, having that type of barrier that keeps the enemy in place is really beneficial as well. Um, makes things a lot easier. And then when you go into the Hersher mode and do her ultimate, really does massive amount of damage. So um, I cannot wait to see how HOR is going to fare in comparison um, when it comes to her Hersher mode and her damage output. Um, now, with her being an elemental Valkyrie, obviously plays a role, and that's going to really determine um, what she's able to do. Uh, because when it comes to elemental Valkyries, um, they are, I wouldn't say limited in where they're really good at, but at the same time, they kind of are. Um, we all know that the physical damage type of Valkyries for at least things like Memorial Arena um, in certain aspects really shine more than elemental Valkyries. But then again, elemental Valkyries have their place as well. Um, whether there's certain weather conditions in that um, abyss. Did I say Memorial Arena? I meant to say Infinity Abyss, Diraxi, um, Q Singularis, things of that nature, where there's weather buffs and um, uh, th certain things of that nature that will help an elemental Valkyrie sh outshine a physical damage uh, Valkyrie. But in most cases, the physical damage dealer Valkyrie will um, be more beneficial. But it really all depends on your situation, and I think at times um, it doesn't really matter. It's you know they're they're gonna do damage regardless. So um, that is the gameplay. That is this is the discussion that I did want to have today, and I would love to go ahead and continue that in the comments below. Um, but let me go ahead and get back onto the ship, and we'll go ahead and get on out of here. All right, my boy, so that is the video. I hope you enjoyed the content. I hope you enjoyed what you saw today. If you did, go ahead and drop a like. It's greatly appreciated. It means a lot to me. And if you're new to the channel, you enjoyed what you saw today, you enjoyed the gameplay, you enjoyed the discussion, go ahead and consider subscribing as we are on our way to 10,000 subscribers. Join the family today. And remember to hit notification bells to stay notified. Notification bells, like there's multiple bells you can click. <laughs> <laughs> hit the notification bell to stay notified every time I do upload a new video or go live. But with that being said, I am going to get out of here. Remember, continue the discussion below in the comments section. And if you really want to go ahead and discuss Honkai Impact 3 with like-minded people, go ahead and join the Discord. That'll be in the description below. Um, click the link. It'll bring you to the Discord where you have many of individuals who discuss the game on a regular basis. And it is a really good time over there. Um, but with that being said, I am going to get out of here. Remember to stand out, be different, have fun, go further beyond in everything that you do. And until next time, my boys, until next time, it's your homie Cody GT, and I'm out.